to beat this. How you gonna do? Where you gonna, where you gonna put a diamond in? What are you gonna do? Put it in your cheekbone? What are you gonna do? Put it in your chin? What are you gonna do? Put it and that put in your forehead who you think he is. Boy, Doughboy TV back in this thing with another topic on the flow, man. If you want to become a part of Doughboy TV gang, the only thing you got to do is comment DBTV down in the comments, man. You're officially a part of the gang. You already know how we step in topics on the flow. DBTV gang, what's good, man? We back in this thing with another topic on the flow. For today's video, we got Sauce Walker and Lil Uzi Vert, man. But before we get in the video, y'all know I asked y'all to like the video. It does help YouTube basically get my videos out there so they can get promoted so everybody can see them man let's get straight in the video so Lil Uzi Vert recently went to Elion Jeweler and he bought a diamond piece that was worth 24 million dollars man now everybody probably looking at this like man jewelry I just want to throw this out there and like diamonds hold their value you get what I'm saying not saying diamond crusted uh grills diamond crusted watches i'm talking about diamonds their self that's a big diamond that's gonna hold his value so if he paid 24 million pretty sure he's gonna at least be able to get 23 million so that's actually a great investment let's put that out there but sauce walker made one of those great investments too a lot of people remember that sauce walker did and he was the first person to get a huge diamond put into his face you get what i'm saying and it looks like i'm just saying this from the outside looking in it does look like oh uzi vert is following this man and taking basically his drip and knowing that he's on a bigger platform than sauce walker and knowing that if he uses it people gonna think he started the trend now another thing that i do want to put this out there because a lot of people was hitting me up saying that you know Lil uzi vert said that sauce walker was one of his influencers meaning that he looks up to him so maybe he paying homage but it's like when somebody else creates a trend and then you kind of do the same thing you want to at least include their name you know be like oh man uh you know pay homage really be like man sauce walker gave me this idea whoop de whoop whoop because other than that it looked like you kind of taking this idea and knowing that you're on a huge, very 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 bigger platform I'm talking about Lil Uzi Vert then Sauce Walker people are gonna look at him and people are more fans of Lil Uzi Vert and they're gonna just make it that okay Sauce Walker Hayden and it's kind of the same scenario of a rapper right blowing up and then his ops not blowing up and then saying something people gonna look at the ops like man y'all just hating when they don't know the prior history and you know a lot of people don't know that Sauce Walker and Lil Uzi Vert they drip kind of been looking the same for like since 2000 what 17 ish but that's my opinion y'all gotta let me know because i don't want beef to start behind this but it you know sauce walker don't play about his drip and he and the only thing it is he's a real dude he's a real nigga he just want his homage pay him homage you feel me show respect when it's given you gotta receive it meaning that since you or since sauce walker gave you respect or you feel me gave you the idea to pay homage just pay homage i feel like but if not I mean, it might turn into something that it don't need to be turned into, and it's already too many rappers beefing, and I mean, at least it ain't beefing in the streets, it's beefing over money and jewelry, I mean, maybe they have a, you know, jewelry contest or something of that nature, you never know, man, but hopefully he don't have a situation where, you know, him and Lil Uzi are beefing like him and Young Thug, man, that's just what I'm trying to say now, it's your boy Doughboy TV, y'all let me know how y'all feel about this whole situation down in the comments, man, who you think started the trend, because then again, I just thought about this, a lot of people said Lil Uzi Vert had a diamond already in his head, he just took it out, so somebody let me know down in the comments or leave me a link or something to a video showing proof because maybe Lil Uzi Vert did start the trend. He said he been paying on this since 2017, man. So, man, he done put $24 million in it, man. Great investment for both of them soft walkers and Lil Uzi Vert because they will be able to get their money back. But y'all let me know who y'all think started this trend of putting diamonds in their face. Now, Lil Uzi Vert do not have a diamond in his face as time right now i don't believe but he's planning on getting put in so y'all let me know how y'all feel about this whole situation it's your boy dope boy tv if you rock with me subscribe if not kick rock